The little town of New Cumberland is living up to its name because just about everywhere you look downtown, you'll find something new. And so it should be no secret that the business scene here is heating up. It was my interest to open a restaurant for a long time. Tenzin Norbu opened his Himalayan restaurant Yak and Yeti a few weeks ago, hoping for a gradual start. But turns out he could not serve up food fast enough. The county has been very welcoming. All the neighbors, all the business owners, they come and help each other. It was a domino effect. Steve Washburn is watching the downtown take shape and faster than he'd expected. It helps everything. It helps everybody's property values. It helps the tax base. It provides employment for people. One of the biggest properties downtown, the old Coakley's restaurant, is still closed and still vacant. But for the first time in a long time, every other storefront downtown is filled. Four new business owners are holding grand openings on Saturday, including Kristen Denunzio, who's bringing a taste of the Hawaiian shore to the West Shore. And she said this spot was a no-brainer. No one wants to move in on a block where half of it's sitting empty. But that's not the case here, where now you can shop for blocks. In New Cumberland, Map Arcaro, News 8.